Welcome back. Now we will try to understand about raster data storage methods or raster data compression techniques. Now uh, we know that raster data is quite voluminous than the vector data um, because it uh, is given in the form of cell pixelated cells and it takes a uh, lot of your storage data storage. So there uh, are different uh, types of data storage which basically may also compress uh, you know that data and lessen the burden on your storage devices. So we can dif uh, distinguish different ways of storing data, uh, raster data are available uh, which vary in storage size and consequently in geometric organization of the storage. On the basis of uh, you know geometric elements following uh, in, in raster data storage these uh, geometric elements have been identified which is lines, stripes, tiles, areas or hierarchy of resolution. So we can store uh, you know raster data uh, by adopting any of these geometric elements. We can have the data in the form of lines, we can have it in, in, in stripes, this raster data in the form of tile, tiles, in the form of areas, quad trees or hierarchy. Now how, what, what about data raster uh, compression? Raster compression is the way of improving raster space efficiently is data compression. It is the way of improving raster space efficiency and uh, there are different types of uh, raster data compression. Now the first one being full raster coding. There is no compres compression in this in this uh, you know uh, type of uh, coding. Uh, by convention raster data is normally stored row by row from the top left corner. You can see the top left is here the data is stored in the first row, then in the second row, then in the third row, then in the fourth row, then in the fifth row. And you can see there is no way that the uh, amount of data uh, has uh, efficiency has been achieved in this. So you can see the uh, in the raster tile format the data is stored for, for this row is stored, then uh, this row is stored, then this row is stored, then this row is stored and accordingly those have been given the uh, legend based on the values. Now what's the problem of this data? It has big amount of data. There is no practically no uh, compression. Now another type of uh, data compression technique is run, le run length coding and uh, uh, you know it is uh, lossless and it's based on the principle that all things are related but nearby things are more related than distant things. So therefore, instead of repeating pixel values, as in the first case, we can code the raster as pairs. Like we can see here, if we know that these are the similar pixels based on the principle that run length code, code is based on, we see that this is one, two and three. This is row number three. So here we write row number three, then second and third pixel belong to the same category and six pixels, same category and 8, 9 and 10 pixel belong to the same category in row number 3. Then in row number 4, it's all together from uh, cell number 1 to 10, all belong to the same category. Then row 5, it is the one pixel from pixel 1 to 9 belong to the same category. So this way you can see the huge amount of data has been, you know, avoided to be replicated. So we call all we can call all these cells as A and all these cells and B all these cells as C and D. So in a way we uh, you know uh, achieve an efficiency in uh, data compression. This about run length coding, but it goes in single direction from in row uh, row only. Now we have block wise coding, which is the modified version of run length code. This method is generalize generalization of run length code uh, run length encoding to two dimensions now, earlier we used only rows to encode uh, the data but now we use columns also to quote uh, to understand this from this example we can say row 1 and column 1 means row 1 and column 1 
रो वन गोज अप टू फोर सेल्स कॉलम वन गोज अप टू फोर सेल्स फॉर द सेम कैटेगरी विच इज डिपेक्टेड हेयर इन ग्रीन सो वी राइट साइज इज फोर एंड द वैल्यू इज आर आर इज हेयर द ग्रीन कलर देन वी मूव टू रो वन एंड कॉलम फाइव दिस इज द रो वन एंड फॉर फ्रॉम फिफ्थ कॉलम एंड एंड इन द इन द फिफ्थ कॉलम वी वी से रो वन एंड फिफ्थ कॉलम इज वन द साइज इज वन एंड रो वन सिक्स कॉलम द साइज इज वन रो वन सेवेंथ कॉलम एंड रो वन एट कॉलम लाइक वाइज एंड इन 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 कॉन्सिक्वेंटली यू कैन सी इन रो टू हेयर इज द रो टू एंड इट इट इट्स द फिफ्थ कॉलम फिफ्थ कॉलम इज वन गिविंग यू दिस डब्ल्यू विच इज दिस ब्लू कलर सो दिस वे दिस इज द मॉडिफाइड वर्जन ऑफ रन लेंथ कोड विच गोज इन टू डायरेक्शन रोज एज वेल एज कॉलम्स टू जनरलाइज बेस्ड ऑन द रिलेशन ऑफ द नियरेस्ट यू नो नियरेस्ट डेटा अवेलेबल हैविंग द सिमिलैरिटी ऑफ बींग द सेम वैल्यू दो द वैल्यूज आर नॉट रिपीटेड एंड द एंटायर वैल्यूज दैट हैव द सेम सेम वैल्यू आर रिप्रजेंटेड बाई वन कोड सो अनदर इज कॉट्री टेसिलेशन इट्स ऑल्सो लॉसलेस इज द मोस्ट कॉमन कॉम्प्रेशन मैथड अप्लाइड टू रास्टर डेटा एंड हाउ इज इट बेस्ड इट स्टोर्स द इंफॉर्मेशन बाई सब डिवाइडिंग ए स्क्वायर रीजन इन टू कॉड्रेंट्स दिस इज द स्क्वायर रीजन एंड इट हैज बीन डिवाइडेड इन टू कॉड्रेंट्स ईच ऑफ विच मे बी फर्दर सब डिवाइडेड इन स्क्वायर अंटिल द कंटेंट्स ऑफ द सेल्स हैव द सेम वैल्यूज now this is this is a big block it is divided into quadrants because the values are different so the quadrants being 1 2 1 3 7 31 8 8 and 8. so 1 1 1 and 1 these or all, all these four tiles remain same so this is not further uh, subdivided 3 these four remaining same this is not further subdivided 8 all the values remaining same not further subdivided but here in this block all the values all the pixel values are different so it needs to be subdivided into 7 10 31 and 11 now while looking at this 1 3 uh, you know this is 1 3 and 8 remains undivided and this block is divided into 7 10 31 and 11 and now you can see if we further subdivide this 10 here into sub blocks you can see how these are again divided into uh, further um, squares and uh, this is uh, you can see the area is represented this is how area is represented on the map and this is the this is the quad tree representation of the same you can see this value is undivided this value is undivided and and one of the values is divided into uh, two and these two remain here uh, undivided and one of them is further divided into four here another is divided into four again